Hi, welcome to Bernat.com. Today we're going to be working with Bernat's Knit or Knot Bella, which is this furry yarn here. We're going to be making a knotted scarf. We do have a knitted scarf that you can make with this same yarn. It's on our website. There is a video tutorial which will show you how to make this loop scarf. It's really easy and we take you step by step through it. But what we're going to be making today is this knotted scarf. It's kind of got this keyhole and I'm going to take you through it step by step and show you exactly how to make it. The only skill that you need is how to tie a knot basically. Pretty easy. So let's get our supplies gathered up and we'll get started. So you need your hank of Knit or Knot Bella yarn and a pair of scissors. Okay, now that we have our supplies together, what we want to do is go ahead and remove your yarn from the packaging. So you want to be careful when you're removing your label that you don't tear it because on the back of the label is the patterns for these knit or knot scarves. So you're going to see that your yarn is actually packaged in a loop. It's tied together in three spots. Now with the Bella, it's a little bit hard to find your ties. You just kind of got to go along. And what we want to do is remove these ties with our scissors. So I can feel that there is a knot here. I'm going to go ahead and snip that one out. And I'm just going to feel along till I can find the second tie. And I can feel that there's another one right here. And again, I'm going to snip that. And I know there's got to be a third one. So you just kind of drag your fingers along until you feel where the tie is. So I'm going to snip that tie out, making sure I'm snipping the tie and not my strands of yarn. Okay, so now we have our loop of yarn. So what we want to do is we want to take our scissors and we want to cut through one end of our yarn. So I know it's kind of scary to cut through all the yarn, but I promise you it's going to work out. So all I'm doing is I'm just cutting right through just like that. So now we sort of have this sort of half loop shape like this. So the next step is to go and separate three to five strands of yarn from the grouping. So you just have to kind of gently loosen them apart. It's no no rush, just take your time and just kind of tug out a group of yarns. Okay, so there we are. We've got our three to five strands. I think I happen to have three here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of eye a spot from this middle point about 12 inches down. And I'm going to take these yarns that I separated out and I'm going to tie them into a knot around all my yarns. And I want to leave a little yarn tail so that it can blend in with the yarns once they're hanging down. Now from there, I want to take my yarn, I'm just going to loop it around my hand just to kind of gather it up and make it easier. And what I want to do is I actually want to take this strands of yarn and wrap it around this grouping of yarns. So basically all I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap it around a couple times and every couple wraps I just kind of want to give it a tug to tighten it up and tighten it up as we go around. So and then I want to, what I want to do is I want to go from here all the way around wrapping until I get to the 12 inch point on the other side. Now because this is television I have one at that spot already and here we go. Now I just got to find my ties. So what I want to do, yep, okay. So what I want to do is I just want to take these last ones and once I'm sort of at the same spot, remember we're going from the 12 inches around and down 12 inches and all I'm going to do is take those ends and make a knot and tie that and tighten it up. And there we go. So now I have a knot on this side, a wrap that goes all the way around and another knot on that side. What I want to do is take my two knotted pieces and pinch them together. So I want to hold that and I want to separate a couple strands from the pack here. Let's 
see what I can do here. Grab a couple strands and I want to take those couple strands and I want to wrap it around those two knots, joining them together. And then again, I just want to tie it off into a knot to tighten it up and secure it. And guess what? That's it. You've made your scarf. So I'm going to show you how you can wear your scarf. So all you want to do is just wrap it around the back of your neck and taking your yarn ends and your keyhole, you just want to pull those yarn ends through that keyhole and then adjust it to whatever size you want. You can make it shorter or longer just by trimming it. And that's it. That's all there was to it. So that's it for today. We'll see you again at Bernat.com.